All right, Greyhounds, today we are going to start a series of recognitions for the class of 2021. This week we're going to have our Greyhound Scholars event, and traditionally we would have our scholarship recipients and departmental awards that would be given out on that event, but because of size and the amount of people in the auditorium, we're having to do a little bit different format. So today we're going to kick off the recognition with our scholarship recipients and our departmental awards uh, through this format here with you on video. I just want to say congratulations. There are so many great students that have done great things and are moving on to the next stage of their career and have earned scholarships to recognize them for their achievements and their academic improvements over the four years of being here at Lyman High School. So we're going to start today with our departmental awards and these awards are selected by each of our departments, the English, Math, Social Studies, Science, and so on. And they select the, the student that has gone above and beyond, who has excelled in the classroom and showed a, a great desire for that content area. So we want to take this opportunity to recognize each of these students today and we'll go ahead and kick it off right here. Outstanding Japanese Student of the Year Award goes to Emma Hetrick, nominated by Ms. Imhoof. During her four years in the program, Emma always makes her effort, maintains good grades, and has a deep interest in Japanese culture and language. She is also a reliable student. We wish her continued success in college and beyond. Omeditao! Outstanding Spanish Student of the Year Award goes to Giselle Castaneda, nominated by Ms. Velasquez. Giselle has been my student for two years. She has a gentle character and an assertive personality, which has helped her to be focused and motivated to excel academically. I am very proud of how much she has grown as a student in these past two years. Another Outstanding Spanish Student of the Year Award goes to Saheli Colon Martinez, nominated by Ms. Velasquez. I have known Saheli for three years now since she was in Spanish too. She has always been a committed and responsible student. Saheli took up the challenge of AP courses, challenging herself and succeeding at it. She is kind, hardworking, and focused. It has been a pleasure to have her as a student. Outstanding ESOL Student of the Year Award goes to Jessica Gutierrez, nominated by Ms. Inns. Through hard work and determination, Jessica achieved a 3.1 GPA in her first semester in the U.S. Jessica has been a pleasure to work with, showing up each day both in Seminole Connect and in person, with a smile on her face. Jessica plans to return to her native Columbia to study medicine with the goal of becoming a psychiatrist. Digital Design Student of the Year Award goes to Jensen Custis, nominated by Ms. Stevenson. Jensen is a level four digital design student. He has worked diligently during his high school career, learning Adobe InDesign, Photoshop, and Illustrator, while also expanding his creative skills. Not only is he very talented, Jensen is also willing to help others, comes to class ready to work, and continues to hone his skills in preparation for college and a future career in graphic design. It has been a pleasure having Jensen in class and seeing his ideas come to life in his projects. Marketing Student of the Year Award goes to Kendall Turner, nominated by Dr. Levenhagen. For four years, Kendall has been a part of the marketing program. She has excelled every year. She understands the content and transfers that knowledge in solving marketing problems. She understands how it all works. It came easy to her. Kendall will be successful in all that she does because she understands the marketing concepts. Kendall has been a major participant in DECA. She has served as an officer for two years. She did well in competition for all four years and has competed at state. Her role as an officer was inspiring to those around her. I enjoyed having her serve as an officer. Kendall is very involved in many school activities, but she always found time to work with those who needed her advice and guidance. Kendall Turner is an exceptional student and as she leaves high school and goes on to college, she will continue to be exceptional. Wherever her future carries her, she will be kind, successful, and a leader. Outstanding Engineering Student of the Year Award goes to Michael Bernheim, nominated by Mr. Memon. Michael definitely deserves the Engineering Student of the Year. His senior project was by far the hardest in any of the EDD classes, but he tackled it like a champ. He was not afraid of the project even when the project required knowledge at a much higher level. He worked tirelessly to see it be successful. He is also a fantastic problem solver. Based on his academic performance, diligence, positive attitude, 
I am confident when I say that he is destined to achieve great things. Good luck with your future, Michael. Outstanding English Student of the Year Award goes to Grace Allen, nominated by Mr. Plyler. Grace's passion for English is evident in her love of literature and commitment to writing. Grace is always reading and sharing literary memes with her friends. Grace embraces the task of analyzing fiction and poetry wholeheartedly. She is to be admired for her love of English in a world too often dominated by technology and social media. Grace is keeping the worlds of Dostoevsky, Bonte, and Austin alive. The Fletcher Cockrell Writing Award goes to Navdeep Singh, nominated by Mr. Plyler. Navdeep Singh possesses all of the qualities necessary to be a brilliant writer. He consistently works to hone his craft. This dedication is evident in Nav's growth and maturity as a writer, beginning in AP English language, where he analyzed, argued, and synthesized rhetoric, to now in AP English literature, where he analyzes and interprets prose and poetry. As a writer, Nav is thoughtful, insightful, and creative. All right, congratulations to each of the students for all of the awards that you won today, and look forward to tomorrow as we kick off day two of our recognitions of our scholarship and departmental awards. Thanks, and have a great Greyhound day.